Oh no, don't line up! Don't line up in a f You guys are lining up straight for them. Oh god! Ooh, miss! Oh! <laughs>Welcome back everybody to Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. I'm IGP. Last episode we busted a few myths about this game and then figured out who was the best between the poacher and the archer. Turns out it was the poacher. However, this brought up a lot of conflict between everybody. People are still saying that the archer is better. And then this challenge was presented to me where in order to prove that the poacher is the best, we are going to try to beat the entire campaign using only poachers. Honestly, we beat the last level with the chicken man, with the poachers anyway. So I know it's possible to beat that hard of a level. I don't know about the rest of them, but I think it's totally doable. Let's go ahead and get started. If you want to see more Totally Accurate Battle Simulator or tabs, let me know by leaving a like and commenting down below. If you needed any reason to hit that like button, do it for the children. Let's get started. Okay, level one, we're going to only be able to put down two poachers, which kind of sucks because uh, I don't know how we're going to be able to beat them with just two. Uh, it's going to be kind of hard. I think what we could do is have one here and then one in the back. I'm going to have to do this strategically, probably for a few of these levels. The last level I didn't have to, just spam as many poachers as possible and you got it. But in this one, I think we're going to have to have them all coming after the first guy and then the, the guy in the back is going to back him up. I don't know. This may not work at all. But let's try it out. Okay, so yeah, he's probably going to end up killing his teammate. <laughs> this is going to be the hardest level to do, I imagine. All right, they've already missed. God, they suck. This is so bad. <laughs> this is going to be so bad. What are they doing? Are they hugging him? You're kidding me. Hold on. I was about to say, dude, poachers are OP. Jeez, they took out six of them. Man, I'm thinking we can probably do this side by side. I'm not even joking. Let's try that again. Holy shit. These guys are so OP, it's not even fair. Why do they shoot at the ground first thing? Oh god, two of them down already. Oh god! What? What is happening? This is impossible! If you both survive this, I'm going to- Oh my god. Fucking OP. Are you kidding me? Well, that was easy. I thought that was probably going to be the hardest level to do. Only took me a few tries. To, and it would have worked if I went with that in the first place. That's what I was actually thinking about doing. Jesus Christ. All right, level two. Should be much easier. Let's just do a quick wall. Okay, so this is definitely doable. This is not even going to be an issue because, oh my goodness. Dude, it's just unbelievably OP. I, I'm not even joking with you. Now, the argument is that the archers can move and they stay at a distance like you got to keep them farther back and they'll shoot so that's good but these guys will move into your shit and then pummel your entire face open with a bunch of freaking steel arrows or whatever they might be using anyway let's try it again let's try the method of the line oh we have a lot less people this time okay what do we got boxers and ooh. okay so they got poachers too so this might actually cause some problems all right some of them are behind each other i don't know if that's going to cause any issues come on boxers drop dead Oh my god. Okay, now the poachers are taking us out. See, poachers versus poachers, we're so dead. Oh shit. Did that guy take like, th took two arrows, one in each eye? Jesus Christ. Okay, now let's try to strategically plan this. Okay, so the boxers were down here. We want to kind of, now the boxers are faster than the poachers. So they're going to walk, let's put them down here towards the boxers in a straight line like normal. Uh, but they're going to be able to walk closer at a faster rate and get killed first and then they can turn to these guys and kill them. Okay, yeah, so my, my theory is kind of correct. They are going to get hit before the other poachers start shooting, but I don't know how well this is going to do because the other poachers are going to stop right there. Okay, so we're good. We're good. Oh, no, no. Why are you targeting the wrong guys? Oh, no. No. Oh, it's so done. So do actually, you know what? This is totally possible. I believe. I believe. Oh, God. Never mind. Okay, so rethinking that strategy. We're going to put them back way farther. Let's put them all the way down here in the corner and just wait for them to uh, play that out. Because eventually, too, they're going to line up in kind of a at an angle, right? Essentially, yeah. And then those arrows could possibly trail off and hit the poachers. And the, I don't know. Um, that's wishful thinking, man. This game don't work like that. This is not real life. Realistically, they would turn. Here we go. Okay, we got the full army versus the full army. Yeah, it's, it's done. It's done. Oh, it might be done on our part because we're tripping over the blue guys. Oh, you guys are so lucky. Yeah, all right, good. Very good. Guys, we got this in the back. 
if this happens, if we beat all 10, the, the poachers are OP. Because I doubt that there's any other unit that can do that. There's no other unit that can do that, only them, to win all these levels. We got 1,500. All right, that's pretty much a straight line. Oh, wow. A big straight line. Jesus Christ. Okay, so 50. <laughs> wow. Here we go. This is going to be easy. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Jesus Christ. Just a, a bombardment of uh, arrows. That's ridiculous. So ridiculous. Okay, the middle got fucked up. Holy crap. Well, still one. That was nothing. Dude, we lost, like, what, seven people? I mean, that's a lot of people. Especially if you're friends with them. That's a lot of people. All right, let's do level five. Probably the same thing, to be honest with you. It's probably the same shit. I don't even care if it's straight anymore. I don't need it to be straight. Uh-oh. Okay, so, see, I don't know these levels all that well, but I feel like it's not even going to be a problem. They're hitting them in the legs. They are so smart, too. See, they're, they're programmed smarter than the rest of them. This is crazy. Yeah, it's done. This is done. Easy. In the bag. In the fucking bag, man. That <laughs> shit, blue guy dropped this stuff. He's like, I'm not going down. And he's down. Okay. Level six. Pretty much the same thing. It's probably going to end up changing. I can't recall exactly uh, what each level's like. But I know there's a few difficult ones. Probably when the cannons and stuff come in. I still need two more. Jesus. All right, here we go. The wall. What do we got? Oh, just these guys? What is the... D oh, I see. Okay, so this is like Spartans. Ooh, this might cause a problem. Oh, yeah, because they're going to turn and start killing each other. Ah, uh, no, don't stand in a straight line. Don't do it. <laughs> Holy shit, look at this mess. This guy's like, oh, woe is me. All right, come on. Come on. Okay, so we might be royally fucked. This one, okay, we got to probably think out this strategy a little bit more. Yep, you know what? I can't even watch it. Okay, so what I'm thinking is decoys over here, right? Decoys, and then other guys just kind of spread out over here to shoot at an angle. Because I'm pretty sure they're going to target the group first. They're on that side. So then these guys have room to turn around and shoot and do whatever. And we can have a second line of defense if we really want to. Just kind of back there. Let's put a few more over here. There we go. Okay. I didn't even use the entire full thing, but this should work. Yeah, we got them trapped in. So as soon as they start attacking the first wall, those guys will be able to turn. No problem and just take them out. Second wall. Yeah, this this will work out nicely. Oh my god. <laughs> this is a massacre. See, just, just placing them at different locations it makes all the difference. Doesn't matter if your units are boxers. Okay, crap. This guy's going to take all of them. All right, very sweet. Okay. Oh, wait. We might die, guys. We're going to die. We're going to freaking die. What the hell? Actually, you know what? They might, it might, they might benefit from turning over here, right? Turning right away to be able to do it. Oh, God. They act as one unit. It's like a centipede. It's like the human centipede. Okay, so those guys are going to get so messed up. It's not even funny. They're, what are they even shooting at? They're so close together, it's just not working out. Okay, this didn't- that was just a fail. That was a massive fail. Okay, so... <laughs> this is a very strange setup, but I think it might- might work. Who knows? That's probably not even gonna work. Where are they turning to? They're- they're turning and shooting at something random. Okay. Well, they're all getting pummeled. Hopefully this line can take them out. Hopefully. Yeah, I feel like they would benefit from being as close as possible. There we go. This is much better. Much better. They haven't got touched much, but they're get ah, oh, they're messing up. You guys are messing up here. You're killing your own teammates, first of all. Jesus, that was like six arrows of your friendly fire. And that guy got one in the back of the head. This might be a problem. One guy left. Come on, right in the head. Oh, he exposed it. He exposed it right for you to hit. Dude, look how many freaking arrows this guy's taking. There we go. Right in the shoulder. That's a death strike. Okay, level seven. Now this one I remember was hard because it had the cannon or it had the chariots or the cannonballs. I don't know. Let's just go ahead and test it real quick and see what it is. Cannonball. <laughs> My God, I love that. Okay, let's 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 try let's let's plan this strategically. Let me do that again. We probably want to go to the top and right to take care of those guys. Yeah, we're gonna need multiple lines of defense here. Okay, so let's have these get focused over here. Another line behind them. Actually, let's have that a little bit back. A line behind them. Let's just have a line of guys right here. Okay, so I, I, what a weird slanted face is what we're what we're doing. This is the plan of attack. I think we got it. So these guys should focus all in here, and then these guys on the side could potentially. I don't know what the hell they're doing, to be honest with you. Oh, we're gonna get so messed up. Oh my god. What we're getting knocked over like bowling pins. That's fantastic. I'm super excited to see the outcome of this. Oh my god. 
But we might be able to do- I don't know. I can't judge this right now. I cannot do Oh, Jesus Christ. You okay, man? Oh, right in the face. Right in the kisser. He's so dead. Oh my goodness. It's actually kind of scary. I don't even want to look over here. Oh, they won! They won! Oh no, don't line up! Don't line up in a fucking- Oh, come on, dude. You guys are lining up straight for them. It's done. It's so done. Oh, God! Ooh, miss! Oh! <laughs> so close. I can't believe that almost worked. So the, the fault seems to be the extra stuff. Let's just have another layer back here that's gonna wait. We want to focus them in to the first group and then have the cannonballs actually pummel everyone down. I don't care if I lose these guys. These guys are gonna do all the damage. I imagine. I mean, they're killing their own teammates right now. But we don't want to be in a straight line towards the cannons because that's gonna be death for us. Oh my god, this is so dumb. You guys, you guys can target different people, you know that, right? You don't have to be... God, this is so done. <laughs> it's so hilarious when one of them gets hit in the face with a freaking cannonball. God, alright, come on, take him out. Alright, so that guy's done, that guy's done. Ooh, we might... We might be able to do this. Okay, we have two different targets for them. Yes! Yes! I think we did it. I think we did it, guys. Hell yeah. Eat that shit. Oh, he's so dead. Did he even get an arrow in him? He just died from fear. Okay, level eight. I have no idea. Let's just put something down. Test it out. Okay, we got chariots. <laughs> we got chariots. Let's go ahead and split them up. Let's just do a line, a line, and a line. Not those kind of lines. Okay, perfect. 500 money left. No problem. We still got poachers, though. Those are going to always win. That was actually the biggest mistake I could have ever made. I need to make, uh... Long lines this way. Actually, that's gonna be terrible too. Oh my goodness! How many survived? Not a lot. I honestly don't know what I can do here. This is gonna be a tough one. I'm just kind of setting stuff down, but the chariots can move wherever they want to, really. Alright, here we go. That's so random. They shouldn't be able to take out everyone. Okay, everyone on that side is gonna get taken out, so we just need these guys over here, and then these guys, these guys. There we go. That'll work. Because they're not going to be able to turn- okay, maybe they can. <laughs> Fuck me, dude! Alright, let's just see how this plays out. Terribly. Terribly, might I add. See, the chariots are going to end up killing themselves because they keep running into each other. We got two guys left, it is so done. So done. Okay, so they're going to- they're going to- they're going to hit us no matter what. We just got to stand in a long freaking line back here. That'd be the best option. Let's see. Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Oh! Oh god! <laughs> Well, that's fine. We got a few stragglers, which those are going to be hard to kill. I think they'll still target them. So I'm just basically taking advantage of the AI here and just... Oh my goodness, that was such a mess. Let's make an X. Boom. Boom. This ought to work. <laughs> what kind of formation is this, Captain? Jesus Christ. Yeah, I just love watching this massacre. Okay, I think they just killed all their knights. They're actually weaving in and out of these people. Okay, I have no idea what's happening anymore. That guy's dead. A few of these guys are still dead. One chariot's still alive. He's gonna end up hitting something and dying. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> wow, thank god they're dumb. This might happen, guys. Yeah, it's gonna happen. Sweet! A stroke of luck. Fucking poachers are OP! Jeez. At right, level 9, I'm pretty sure I can just do a straight line. Probably. Let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, goodness. Okay, this shouldn't be too hard. I- I'm missing a few, uh, units. I could've- I could've put more. Oh yeah, ballistas. Keep- keep hitting them. Keep hitting them. Oh my god. <laughs> now this is gonna be the struggle. When we're done with these guys, we have to walk over to the ballistas and not die from them. That's gonna be- whoa, what happened? That's gonna be a little bit difficult. Stay scattered, guys. Oh man, this is so done. Well, they can only target a few people at once. I think all three of them start to target the same person. Or not. No, yeah, they do. They totally do. Okay. Take him out, take him out, take him out. There we go, that's one down. Oh, God! Oh! Man. That's it, right? That's level 9. Then we- I know we can beat level 10. Wow, this is- This is just unfair. This is just absolutely unfair to everybody involved. But yeah, fucking poachers are OP. Type down in the comment section below. Poachers are OP! Now let's see what kind of massacre we can create here. Oh, Jesus. The chickens, though. The chickens, though. Those are some brutal chickens. We're getting so sw Oh my god, he's running too! He's running and just shitting out those chickens. Oh, he's dead though. Yeah, that's so easy! It shouldn't be that easy. This guy's carrying a chicken. He's just celebrating here. 
You beat the pre-alpha, and it should say with a poacher, or with poachers. <laughs> now, to really prove that the poachers are OP, I'm going to try to beat all 10 levels with just one poacher per level. I'm just kidding. That's really fucking stupid, and it's not going to happen. But there you go, guys. There's your- there's- the, the proof is in the pudding. It's totally in the pudding. They're so OP that they- you, you can only- you only have to use them to win. You only have to use them. I can guarantee that there is no other unit that can do by themselves and beat all 10 levels. Just not gonna happen, I'm telling you. First of all, you can't do anything- I'm pretty sure- I'm pretty sure- hold on, let me get to level 1. Okay, so you only have 80, right? Barbarians, probably- you can have four of those. Probably can beat level 1. Four farmers probably can beat level 1. Uh, yeah, so maybe, just maybe, but these guys are not going to fare in the other levels. It's just not going to happen. They're not going to be able to do it. So, other than that, maybe a footman could, but you only can get one in the first level, and a footman is not going to take out eight peasants. Or can he? Let's put that to the test. Let's go! What do you got, man? He's so dead. <laughs> you know, if you just do, like, that, that Zelda spin attack, charge up spin attack, you'll win. Yeah, there's no way. There's just no way. There is just no way. Poachers are OP. And on top of that, they only cost 30. They only cost 30. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Like, share, favorite, and subscribe if you haven't already to keep up to date with all my latest videos. If you have any more suggestions or ideas on what I can do with the sandbox for tabs, let me know in the comment section below as well. Leave a like so I know I should continue. And of course, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.